Take it about a place It'll take creation, imagination Try to draw outside the line Let us Hi, this is Mary from Mary's Stamping Happenings and today is There's a Card Thursday. And on Tips and Techniques Tuesday, I showed you how to make um, a one sheet wonder sheet page and we were using Flurry of Wishes. And these are the cards we're going to be putting together. Turn them around, Mary. These are the cards we're going to be putting together today for them. And what we're going to need is we're going to need the stamp set flurry of wishes i have already used the uh, ink pads uh, pool party so saffron and island indigo we're going to be needing the smoky slate um, stamp pad card stock you're going to need five pieces of eight and a half by five and a half. You're gonna need a full whisper white, uh, plus you're gonna need about a five and a half by eight and a half because we're gonna cut out some circles um, with the uh, um, big shot. I've already done that, but that's what you're gonna need it. You're also going to need a full sheet of island indigo and then a five and a half by eight and a half. Uh, designer series paper, we're going to use the Winter Wonderland Designer Vellum Stack. We're going to need glue dots and Stampin' Dimensionals. We're going to need our stamping trimmer, which we've already used uh, when we cut the uh, One Sheet Wonder. We're going to need our uh, two and a half inch circle punch. We're going to also need our bowl builder punch. We're going to be needing the Big Shot and the Circles Collection. And then we're going to meet, need the templates, which I already showed you in Tips and Techniques Tuesday. So let's get started, and we're going to build the um, cards right now. So this is our template, and this is how I keep everything all to know where everything is. That's our One Sheet Wonder, and this is our Layers template. So I'm going to grab my glue dots and I am going to just, okay, I'm going to use my glue dots and glue these all together. I think I'll just grab my snail. I'd rather have the glue dots because I know the snail um, doesn't stay too well here. If I can find my snail. Maybe, oh, here's my fast fuse. And then I will put this on here. And you can see on the template that I've got card one card two card three card four and things like that so you know on each template where it goes but i like putting all of these together first so this is card five get the blue dot off uh here is um card two Stick that right there. Then I've got card one. So let's see where my card ones are. This is a card one. This is a card one. And this is a card one. So I'm just going to put these together. And you can do this anyway once you get them together. You don't have to do it the same way I have done it. Okay. And this is card three and four. Okay. 
Megan's going to yell at me because I just realized I did that all off camera. Sorry, Megs. I'm used to my other camera who'd go down, way down low. Okay, so I've got those done. And now we're just going to put them together. Um, and I'm going to put this one on top. I love one sheet wonder cards. I think they're really cool. And then this one, I'm going to put on the bottom. And again, you don't have to do it the way I do it. You've got enough to make what, however you want. You can make more than five cards with this. This is on top. This is on by itself. And for a tip, watch when you make sure you do your check mark or they get blue boogers all over that and it won't come out anymore. So now we've got the basis of the cards almost done. And I've already cut out the circles. The white, whisper white circles. So all I have to do then is stamp those with the smoky slate. I like the smoky slate because it looks silver. It sets it off. See those blue boogers? And we're going to take our two and a half inch punch and we're going to punch out some island indigo backgrounds for this. Our glue dots, or not with our glue dots, with our stamp and dimensionals, we're just going to put these suckers on. You got an extra piece of the one sheet wonder here that you can make probably two more cards on. So. I really love, again, I really love this uh, stamp set. And it comes with a punch to punch out those doubles um, in a bundle. Put some more Stampin' Dimensionals on. And you can put these on. Yeah. 
that. And then I'm going to do some bows with our bow builder punch. And I'm sure you're all familiar with the bow builder punch, but what you do is you cut out with the bow, you punch out two times, and that gives you enough. Um, I found my bone folder, see? I got a bone folder. And then you just curl these, put a glue dot, just like that, and then put another glue dot, and hook two of these together that you've curled. And then you're going to take the two tails, put a glue dot on the back of one of those tails, and put those two together, just like that. Then a glue dot on the back of the bow itself. Put that together. Then you're going to take this one and curl it. And then a glue dot on either one, just like that, just like that, and you're just going to wrap it around. And then I'm just going to take a glue dot on the back of these, and we have one. two, three, and I got a glue dot stuck on my thumb and coming off. Four. Five. For There's Card Thursday, One Sheet Wonder, Flurry of Wishes Christmas Cards. Thanks for visiting and happy stamping. Hey, if you want to play, make it about a play.